Hello people, how are you doing? My name is Robin from Consistent Life Balance and my Juice Fest has continued. I'm on day 30 now and I can't believe I already went for 30 days. Um, yeah, so far I can say I had my ups and downs in terms of energy. On some days I felt um, lethargic and weak and on, otherwise, um, on other days I felt um, much more confident, strong and yeah, more overall energy. But I found that it always goes in cycles. On some days, for a period of days, even um, you can be in a deep detoxification period, but then um, it's over again. You eliminate uh, things inside of you which don't belong in there, and then you the energy levels increase, and then the same thing repeats over and over again of the course over the course um, of a few weeks. Yeah, um, so let's talk about um, detoxification. The most phenomenal thing has been my bowel movements. I had them pretty much every single day, ranging from 1 to 4, and also liquid stools and a lot of hard, dry, solid stools and also some string likes, mucus and some grey things inside of them. And um, yeah, I even had one colonic and after that colonic I came home and I had two liquid bowel movements and then following two solid bowel movements uh, again and today yesterday I only drank juice yesterday I had my colonic and today I even had two uh, two more um, solid bowel movements it's like crazy and I can feel that there is still things inside of me which don't belong in there so pretty much every single day I'm eliminating solids matter and I'm only consuming juice with one tablespoon of spirulina in the evening. And I wanted to ask you guys if you think um, if the spirulina could um, hurt my benefits or my success in the juice fest. Me personally I don't think so because I um, put this one tablespoon in a lot of juice and it's like very liquid and um, I hope it won't um, disturb my juice fast. And I'm also taking one to two um, tablespoons of flaxseed oil every single day. Next point are my, is my thyroid gland. Um, I found that it um, starts working better during this juice fast. Um, there's something going on here. Um, like my face is also getting um, tighter and loses its puffiness, which I had before. And yeah, like my thyroid gland now getting more efficient and yeah, better functioning. Because I believe before the fast my body was holding on to something here in the throat area. And um, I've heard it many many times from people who say this uh, when they go on a raw food diet they get a much more tighter face and when they start um, incorporating again cooked foods and um, fats in high amounts um, their face starts to get puffy again. So that's interesting. Next point is my liver. Um, I always had the sensation during the complete fast and um, pretty much every single day something um, cleansing in my liver area and healing. And yeah, on the right side but also um, coming over to the left side because the liver also goes um, a little bit um, on the left part of the body. And yeah, I can feel it there. What I find interesting is that my nose and sinuses are very clogged up all the time. Um, I, al I already had problems before the fast and also since my childhood because I had um, I had a surgery here in my um, I don't know how it calls in English, but um, there was something removed out of my nose, and from there on I always had a clogged up nose. And I hope um, I hope that the juice fast can solve this, but. Um, my body really pushes things through my nose always, like when I'm detoxif detoxifying, my body is always trying to um, use the sinuses to get rid of um, waste matter. And it's like pretty annoying sometimes because um, when I wake up in the morning it's full of mucus and I have to get rid of it and also um, sometimes it's very, um, it's not so great to breathe very deeply when your nose is full of shit. <laughs> Unfortunately, my kidneys are not filtering, so I'm not seeing any sediment in my urine. Um, and I also have not seen it before the fast. 
so and never in my life um, maybe I should test it more times be because I only tested like every three days or so but um, so far I haven't seen any sediment in my urine even when I tried some um, dry fasting but my longest one was um, I think 16 hours and um, even then I didn't see um, any sediment and that was um, strange to me and um, yeah I really want this kidney filtration but uh, because I think it's um, important um, yeah what are your suggestions and um, advice for me because um, I really I think it's very important on the juice fast to get um, the kidneys filtering out the waste matter and um, maybe I will also try some herbs because um, yeah I think I have a kidney weakness because I can see in my eyes my iridology there is um, a weak point in my kidneys you can see it there now my emotions I, I have to say they were pretty stable I'm because I already spent a lot of time with myself and did a, have a lot of um, meditation experience so far and yeah sometimes I felt a little bit um, sad um, but not much more than usual and overall I felt pretty happy I, I always try to have a positive um, mindset every single day to motivate myself to get through the day and I also didn't have any cravings no hunger at all and no cravings for anything my mother can do any dish beside uh, when I'm choosing in the kitchen she can cook whatever she wants I don't care I don't care fuck and also when I'm shopping I don't care about smells it's just a miracle because before I always had like um, always had like cravings for things and now they're completely away maybe it also has to do with um, because I used a lot of spices in the beginning so I, I used a lot of ginger because I maybe killed some parasites and also some cayenne pepper um, yeah but I don't know because I already did a long longer water fast and maybe I or eliminated there are some parasites and also um, healed some emotional parts because I think um, cravings are also um, often triggered by emotions because um, yeah I learned that I eat to live but not live to eat I think that is very important and yeah I don't use food to distract myself or use food to suppress um, emotions in my in myself my last point is the exercise I'm doing yeah you know I'm doing strength training I mentioned it in the videos before I will put some clips below in the posing video but so far I can say um, I can maintain my muscle my strength I'm because I'm drinking six to eight liters which um, and also a um, lot of vegetable juice as I mentioned um, one to one um, tablespoon spirulina a day one to two tablespoons flaxseed and then a lot of green 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 vegetable juice I try to um, keep it organic as much as possible, but sometimes, yeah, um, some some um, sugar melons are just um, so cheap and so good in quality. If even though they are conventional, so I and even though I buy them, yeah, um, I can. That's phenomenal that I can maintain my strength, my muscle, and um, yeah. But I honestly also have to say that I couldn't pack on like a lot of more um, weight on my exercises and um, also my muscle aches is a little bit um, longer after my workout so I have to rest um, some more days because I think um, before I had more uh, amino acids and now on the juice fast I only eat um, about 60 grams of protein and I think um, for optimal recovery that's not good enough but um, yeah, I'm not doing the juice fast for building muscle. I'm doing the juice fast for cleaning out my GI tract and allowing all my glands, organs and um, tissues in my body to heal.
So I hope you enjoyed the clips guys and if you have any questions or advices just ask them down below in the comment section. I'm very excited how my Juice Fest will continue and of course I will keep you guys updated. And yeah, that's it. Um, have a great day. See you. Peace.